Let's take a quick look at a couple of neat features which demonstrate how lead perfection can improve the quality of leads. We're back on the contact detail page, and there are a couple of buttons that should be pointed out. First are the two mapping buttons. Lead Perfection has a built-in link to Microsoft Map Point and another link which can be configured to point to various Internet-based mapping websites. In order to use Microsoft Map Point, one would need to have it installed on their workstation, and all they would do is click on the American Flag Map button, and Map Point would pop open in another window with the address of the prospect already selected. The same works with Internet-based mapping websites, which we'll demonstrate now. In this demo, we've pre-configured Lead Perfection to point to MapQuest, which is one of the most popular mapping websites on the Internet. By clicking on the Globe button, a new window pops open with the location of the current prospect already selected. One could also set up Lead Perfection with a standard starting point, such as an office address, and have MapQuest automatically generate the driving directions from there to the current prospect. All of this is being done with just a single mouse click. Another great benefit of Lead Perfection is how Internet search engines are used to assist in finding the correct phone numbers for prospects when they have been dialed and the number is determined to be incorrect. In many cases, the person doing the dialing is not going to take the time to research the prospect because it's just too time-consuming. But with Lead Perfection, we make that as simple as just a few clicks of the mouse. In our example here, let's suppose we are trying to dial Irene Jackson but end up getting a Chinese restaurant instead of Miss Jackson. We can then select from a choice of search engines in the drop-down. We'll try Anywho, which is run by AT&T. When we click on the Lookup button, a window pops open with Anywho search results. Sure enough, the phone number we have in the system is actually for the Asian buffet. So now we can select a different search option and try again. We change our drop-down to search by first initial, last name, and zip. This time, when we click, we get Irene Jackson. And if we look carefully, we can see that the last two digits of the phone number were simply transposed. So there it is. With just a couple of clicks, we've salvaged this lead and prevented it from being discarded.